What's up everybody? It is your boy Everything TV and so I'm coming at you with another brand new video. And today we're talking about the stimulus check that all the Americans are waiting for, all the people are waiting for. Um, I'm going to go over a little bit about what's happening here. A lot of people have gotten their stimulus checks and others haven't. And the other people are like, well, why didn't I get it? Am I going to get a check mailed? Is it going to take six months? Is it going to take this? Is it going to take that? The answer to that question is possibly yes. Um, so a lot of people who have filed their taxes obviously use parties like TurboTax or H&R Block or third-party companies that file your taxes for you. You just do it online and you get your taxes and that's that. A lot of people have been using those companies and those companies have been fronting out money, whether it's 200, 600. Some people have even got like 500, 400, 200. And they're like, well, where's the rest of it? Well, those companies are fronting their own money to companies to give them for their taxes. They're fronting money to companies and just putting the money in the bank. That's why you see it as pending and giving it to you until you get the, t the check and then obviously it'll cover the funds. Um, that's one thing that's happening. Another thing that's happening are the lower uh, amount people. Like if you have, <clears throat> now this is in some cases, but the people who have just, it's just a couple or one person, they're getting theirs first from what I understand. From what I've been seeing is a lot of people who are single or coupley joint are getting theirs first. Now, if you have more, if you have more dependents, which are children, if you have children, you know, obviously more dependents and your check is larger in the 4,000, 5,000 range, then obviously you're going to have to wait for yours a little bit longer. So that's what's happening as well. We should start seeing a next batch. Now, I heard that this is going on batches. Every Friday, they're going to be making deposits. The IRS will be making deposits into your account every Friday. So if you didn't get it last Friday, the way it looks like is you're going to be getting it the next Friday. Now, if you have banks that allow direct deposits to be deposited sooner, uh, like some people might have Social Security and their date is the first, but they get it on the 26th or something like that. That's how that will work. So you might get it Wednesday or Thursday as opposed to having to wait till Friday. But that's the whole thing that's going on here is um, pretty much... The, the, the bank also really depends because certain banks are, have already got them like this, like that. Certain people have got them before the even release date. Those weren't your stimulus checks. Also, if you filed for unemployment and you got $600, that was your unemployment check, not the uh, stimulus check. It's part of the whole package, but it's different. So, you guys, um, don't be letting everybody give you this false information. Um, I'm looking at what I've been seeing and what I've been told people I've spoke with. Uh, if you have larger dependents, more dependents, your check is not going to be here till next week and possibly further out. Also, another issue that we're having as well is that people, some people just, you know, they get their TurboTax card or whatever card they're, they're using and they just throw the card away when they spend the money, pull the money out, throw the card away, cancel the card. Whatever. So the IRS does not have your bank information, then they cannot direct deposit it. So where does that money go? Do you wait? Well, if you don't update your information, and we'll get to how to do that in a second, your um, stimulus check is just going to go to the back end, which will be towards your income tax next year. So if you normally get $5,000 next year and you're expecting a $5,000 stimulus check, then they're going to add that $5,000 to that stimulus check and you'll get $10,000 instead. That's how that works. Um, the IRS is working with TurboTax. If you go to TurboTax.com, the IRS is working with them to have you update. It'll direct you to the page, but you have to update your uh, banking and accounting around the number by the 17th. I believe that believe that website's supposed to be up. So if you have not filed your taxes, make sure to file your taxes. If you have not updated your bank information, make sure you go to the IRS website when the, when the, when the portal is up and running to put your banking and accounting routing number. You can even track your direct deposit and see where that's going. And that will be available on the 17th of April. So there's a lot of great tools that you guys can use to track your stimulus check. Now I know a lot of people are waiting on these stimulus checks. Uh, a lot of people are um, trying to get them because it's tough times right now. I do want to advise <clears throat> if you are obviously, you know, in need, um, there's a lot of programs that are being offered right now for rental assistance. There's programs for like the utility companies are working with you to waive late fees. Um, I know evictions are down uh, because evictions are cut off. 
Uh, they're power companies, cable companies. They're, they're, they're working with people to not shut them down. Um, when you get these, th that does it. But listen, see, a lot of people are like, well, I'll just call my cable company and say I can't pay it. Or I'll call my light company and say, hey, I'm not going to pay that bill. I can't pay it this month. I got, we got time. We not, what you're not realizing is that they'll give you more time. They'll extend it, extend it, extend it. But you're going to have a huge huge bill guys you're gonna come when this might be over middle of may end of may whenever this happens you might be stuck with a 900 dollars bill now yeah they've helped you they've helped you extend it but you have to make payments on your bills guys so what i would highly recommend is if you're getting a 1200 dollars stimulus check that's that's all you're gonna get for a long time if you're just by yourself now if you have a family bigger you know obviously you'll get more Pay your bills. Pay half of your bills. Pay a portion of your bills. Make a payment on something. Because this is going to be the last money you're going to get for a while. Um, I don't think they're going to do this again. I'm not too sure about it. Uh, but, guys, I, I highly advise that you guys put your money into some, into your bills. Don't be like, oh, I just got to write. I'm buying a car. I'm buying. I'm going to go buy my books. <laughs> no, 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 no. Chill, chill, chill. Put your money away and save up your money guys um because we don't know how long this is going to last and most for most of us this money isn't that money isn't enough for you guys that money might not be enough for you guys to make it another month you know because you're already backed up but if you at least pay some of that money towards some of those bills and and not go crazy shopping for bullshit you know you guys will you guys will, can make it you know just don't I, I, I hope you guys don't go crazy shopping. Like, you know, that's a, that's the thing about income tax check, right? When people get that income tax check, they're, like, they're buying a car, they're buying shoes, they're buying, and then it is gone within the first week. Um, I advise you to save your money because we don't know how long this is going to last. Maybe go get some essential stuff like toilet paper, hand sanitizer, diapers, wipers, whatever you need. Get your, get your bills caught up. You know, don't go buy a new car. Because these car companies are waiting for you guys to get the stimulus check. These car companies, they're 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 salivating. <laughs> as soon as they heard Donald Trump passes 4.5 trillion stimulus check package, they're like, oh, just drooling. They're like, yes, yes, 1,200 bucks. Were, you know, and that's and that's same thing for those rent center companies and enterprise guys. Save your money. This is a tough time right now. Last thing a lot of you guys need are more bills to add to the debt so use your money wisely please um make sure you save up if not push for a rainy day which is just this is your rainy day guys if if you guys don't if you guys don't know what a rainy day fund is a rainy day fund is pretty much money you save up it's money you save up for a time like this a rainy horrible day and a lot of people did not do it. <clears throat> a lot of people have did not have their money saved up. And we just got, what, taxes? Well, I think April's the last month or something. But a lot of people didn't, you know, already file their taxes and got their taxes. Large amounts. And they're gone. They don't have it. They're asking people for money. They're actually, you know, it, it's the it's, it's way of, of Americans. We, we get money and we spend it. You know, not that many people believe in saving anymore. Not that many people are traditional to save money into their bank account and to to go hard no they don't do it you know it's just not the american way the american way is get money spend it fast um but yeah guys so pretty much that's what we're waiting on if you're still waiting on your stimulus check you can expect that a lot more people could start expecting to see deposits in the upcoming week uh hopefully if you have uh you know bank like american express serve uh some other cards that do offer faster deposits then you guys like NetSpend, NetSpend customers, a lot of NetSpend customers already got it. I know TurboTax cards, people are waiting for it. Um, some bank accounts have showed up as pending, which just means that the government, or not the, the government is, is giving everybody these checks. And these companies know. They're trying to avoid huge, uh, you know, uh, uh, breakdowns in their system. Wait, you know, for their, their car. And all these customers are going to get this money and they're going to be a hole in the hall. System's going to freeze. So they're just giving these people their own money. They know it's coming. So they're like, here's 600 or here's, you know, that, those are those are the companies paying you in advance because they know they're going to get that money. If, they, if they've established that you filed your taxes with that, with that card, then they're just paying you back your own money. So next, next Friday, a lot more people should start seeing direct deposits, possibly even Monday from the last week's direct deposit hit. But... It's going towards the people who don't have as much. 
So, you know, if you have $1,200, you're going to get it first more faster than someone who's getting a six dollars $5,000 check. Uh, that's just how it works. But that's how they're prioritizing it. So, yeah, guys, remember, please save your money, pay your bills. Use the stimulus check wisely, guys. Uh, with great funds comes great responsibility. Hashtag that in the comment section. If you're new to the channel, make sure you drop a like and hit that sub. Uh, if you like these videos, I will do more videos about this. Uh, just let me know, guys. And uh, stay safe during this crazy pandemic. And I hope every single one of you guys have an amazing day. Happy Easter, guys. Man, I love to every single one of you beautiful people. Peace.